Gentlemen, you had talked about in a prior interview staying true to your content, but also working with brands and incorporating that into your content. I know you have um, a very successful YouTube channel, and I'm wondering what your thoughts are and what your advice is to other creators on staying true to your brand, being able to make a lifestyle from doing the videos, but also incorporating paid sponsorship. I, I think brands are actually kind of cool now, a lot cooler than they used to be. I think that they, they're finally getting the uh, um, content creation element to it. So as long as the creators are staying true to their content and incorporating the brand rather than highlighting the brand or making it seem like it was just for the brand, I think is a cool approach to do it where you can get a paycheck for yourself, you can get your production funded, and also you could work in the brand placement in a nice subtle way rather than hitting your viewers over the head with it. Um, but ultimately it just comes down to staying true to your vision, staying true to your followers and being communicative with everybody that out there that to let them know like, you know, we have this coming up from the great people of Coca-Cola or, you know, whoever the brand is. You're not making Matthew McConaughey Lincoln commercials, but you're making, you know, something that your viewers would expect you to make and incorporating the brand that way. Yeah, I mean, I think it's – brands are much more – like the storytelling of commercials is, is a much bigger thing now than it is. I feel like even, you know – and, and part of it, I think, is just the evolution that commercials are sort of disappearing a little bit with the rise of these kind of digital platforms. Advertising is going to have to be more, brands are going to have to be naturally more integrated into things because there are fewer people like watching actual, you know, advertisements on, you know, cable TV or network TV. So I think that's part of it. I also think, this is going to sound kind of brash, but I think the idea of like selling out is kind of bullshit. It's like this weird sort of, I don't know, this Western idea that like you can love you can love a creator and then the second that they're actually able to support themselves doing what they do, you, you like that makes their creating less less interesting. I think that that's kind of a weird, like fucked up myth that is of like of I don't know, this kind of it's just a weird creation. And I, so I think it's I always unnecessary say, angst. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's like why why not support the person who like who finally like gets to do the thing, gets paid to do the thing that they love to do. I, it's it's uh, sort of a strange relationship. But if you know any brands, we're looking. So. <laughs> if any brands are watching this, we're happy to say. <laughs> <laughs>